And Fox 11's Allison Struve joins us now live from the scene. Good morning, Allison. Good morning, Rachel. As you can tell, there is some work being done already on this sinkhole. The road is still closed here from Highway G all the way to Breezewood Lane, this section of Highway 76. We're with Bill Demler, who's the highway maintenance uh, superintendent here in Winnebago County. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm okay. You guys are dealing with a problem here. Can you tell us how this happened or when you found out about it? Uh, with all the heavy rain yesterday, the culverts got plugged up with a lot of the long grass, uh, plugged up the culverts, then the water started coming over the road and it started washing out the shoulder, then it worked its way under the pavement and made it a big void and then the pavement actually uh, collapsed uh, late yesterday afternoon. So what's happening right now? Uh, we're digging out the old asphalt and we're going to fill the hole back in with uh, new gravel and we're just going to do a temporary fix with some cold patch over the top just so we can get the road open for the weekend. So do you have a time estimate on how long that'll take? I'm hoping we have it done around noon. Okay. So uh, I think we'll be pretty close to that. Is this something that you deal with pretty often or is this a rare thing to happen? Uh, actual road washouts don't happen a lot. Uh, over the past seven, eight years, we've had quite a bit of flooding. Uh, this is probably about the third or fourth one that we've had, but the first state highway that washed out on us. A lot of mostly town roads and once in a while a county highway. So is it's just the culvers, it's not that the road was built poorly or that oh, someone's no, a problem? No, there was not, nothing wrong with the structure of the road, just the, the culverts got plugged up. Um, and, the, and then the water had to go over it. And, and you don't want to just automatically change these to bigger pipes because you don't know what it'll affect downstream. So um, that'll be something the DOT will determine. And as for the rest of the area that you deal with, have you been dealing with any other problems or has most of the water gone down? Uh, most of the water is receding. Uh, last night we had a few uh, high water signs we had to put out. But uh, all in all, for all the rain we had, it hasn't been too bad yet. Uh, now they're expecting more rain tonight. I hope we don't get that. <laughs> I think everybody's with you on that. All right, thanks. Thank you so much. So, again, they're working on it here to get it fixed, hopefully by noon, um, he said. But until then, avoid this section of Highway 76. Right